First I'm going to take off the coolant overflow bottle. So I get access to the engine a little better. Now I'm going to take off the right hand part of the front cover, the starters, see what we got. Now the worst part is I've got to take the pulley off, the main crank pulley, to get the rest of the cover off. I'm going to have to do that anyway if I replace the timing belt tensioner so that I can reset the timing. AC belt off. Now I'm going to take off the uh, radiator fans. I've already disconnected the two electrical connectors at the bottom. One. First of all, I'm going to put on my homemade tool to stop the thing turning. Then I'm going to put in my socket, and I know I talked this up to mega joules, mega whatever. So now I'm going to see if I can get this thing off. There we go. Okay. Taking care not to damage the radiator. There is the crankshaft pulley bolt. And let's see if it is. Wow, it's loose already. Whoa, how about that? Now, I've got to get this cover off and the myriad of bolts. Okay. Get up. I'm Ah. There it is. Oh. And as they say in England, Bob's your uncle. Okay. Let's see what we've got here. So far this has taken me uh, 15 minutes probably. Okay, let's start her up and see what happens. Shaking, all right.
That's what it is. Damn. Okay, off she comes. 